Thank you for your uh, introduction. Uh, my name is Miwako Doi, the chair of Working Group One. The sub chair is uh, Dr. Kitano. And uh, Working Group One uh, title is Expanding Human Potential Toward a Society in which Everyone Can Pursue Their Dreams. Uh, mm, the, uh, we uh, discuss about the cyborg technology and uh, avatar technologies and so on. So uh, this slide shows uh, our vision of uh, uh, our vision, uh, symbiotic diversity society 2050. So this vision is uh, and uh, harmonious uh, people are uh, empowerment uh, in order to realize the uh, society and uh, in which human beings can be free from their limitations of body, brain, scale, uh, and time, and time. So uh, the, we discuss the cybernetic avatar society see, uh, in order to create disrupted and uh, social technological changes in Japan. Uh, cybernetic avatar. It is a concept that includes not only uh, remote avatars using robots and 3D uh, images as a proxies, but also uh, empowerment of the physical, uh, cognitive activities of human using ICT and robotics. So cybernetic avatar aims to be active not only in the physical world, but also in the cyber physical world. So maybe uh, it's next um, society, I think. <coughs> Sorry. <coughs> this um, this slide shows uh, <coughs> and and uh, uh, our uh, discussing points. We uh, discuss the from the four points. The first point is uh, freedom from body limitations. The second um, point is uh, freedom. Uh, from brain limitations. Third point is uh, freedom from space limitations and time limitations. And lastly, we discuss from the uh, point uh, human in the cyber physical system group. And the, uh, the first, from the first point, and uh, the Professor Inami uh, noted the cybernetic avatars and uh, uh, Professor pra Pratikizo and uh, uh, introduced and uh, his uh, augmented human and research and development and uh, results. So he said the augmentation human body with robots and after that uh, augmented human and another humans and uh, communicated with uh, the, uh, each other. It's a, a new point, I think. And, uh, and uh, the commentator, uh, the, uh, the Dr. Kitano, this uh, and the big challenge of Moonshot is that these cybernetic uh, avatar technologies must be uh, implemented in the real uh, physical world and uh, make the, uh, the industries and, and make the money. It's a big challenge, he said. <laughs> okay? <laughs> and, uh, and next point is the freedom from the brain limitations. And uh, uh, Professor Kano, uh, the, uh, 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 noted that uh, the, uh, the brain functions, for example, the decision creation, emotion, and uh, cognition, and these uh, brain functions are empowered and, and uh, uh, com uh, committed to the uh, cybernetic avatar capitalism for diversity and inclusion, and cybernetic avatar life, daily life, cybernetic usage. And so, the presenter, Professor Watanabe, he uh, introduced the, uh, the online magnetic resonance spectroscopy and neurofeedback. He said 
the online, uh, he, he said that using the online MRS neurofeedback uh, make the uh, elder person to the super old individuals like this. And the commentator, uh, Dr. Hagita, said the, another uh, the question. So after uh, cybernetic avatar capitalism and uh, cybernetic avatar life, these technologies are committed, create new brain functions. It's a big problem, and it's and uh, um, interesting uh, issues from the research. I think the third point: free freedom from space limitations and time limitations. Uh, Dr. Kitano uh, uh, introduced the uh, capitalism and how to uh, monetize, how to uh, create, how to disrupt it, the uh, in order to. Uh, new uh, architecture, uh, uh, new architectural society. So, uh, Dr. Locke from XPRIZE, he introduced uh, uh, many XPRIZE uh, projects and um, awards projects, and he mentioned avatar applications. So, uh, the, he presented the physical robotic avatars can be used. Uh, across a range of possible real world, uh, so on. And the, uh, no, uh, uh, commented a professor Inami, he in, introduced uh, uh, the uh, new uh, type of virtual conference. So he said uh, the next moonshot symposium and be, will be held on the uh, virtual conference, he said, yeah. <laughs> The uh, last point is uh, uh, common technologies, human in the uh, cybernetic uh, 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 CPS loop. Uh, uh, Professor Higashino, he is a facilitator, and he mentioned the research issues for future ICT infrastructure. The, in the 5G, uh, the, uh, the uh, multi band and uh, uh, low latency and massive devices. But uh, 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 realized, but it's independently realized. So, but after that, it, for the cybernetic avatars, we must simultaneous uh, real simultaneous uh, realization dom uh, of those three point three features. And uh, Dr. Carbot from NSF. Uh, uh, introduced the U uh, NSF projects AI and others, and he mentioned the city sites ICT platform. So um, maybe the city OS, and uh, he uh, introduced the uh, Manhattan and uh, uh, another uh, uh, projects. Uh, and he mentioned, lastly, the trust is the most important. I agree with him. So, uh, commentator, uh, Dr. Tokuda, uh, he introduced the uh, inner cities and beyond 5G at telehealth communication technologies and the communications uh, with uh, brain signals. So, he must uh, mention that safety uh, is an uh, important uh, key factor. I agree with him. So, lastly, we conclude our moonshot goal can candidate is by 2050, realization of the society in which human beings can be free uh, from their limitations of body, brain, space, and time with harmonious empowerment. For uh, We have two targets, cybernetic avatar cap capitalism for diversity and inclusion, and by 2050, uh, develop technologies and infrastructure to carry out large-scale complex tasks using combinations of large numbers of avatars and robots that are uh, teleoperated by multiple persons. The second target is uh, cybernetic avatar life. Uh, for daily life, anyone willing shall be able to augment their physical, cognitive, and perception uh, capabilities to the level of the best experts of selected domains. So 
we must need the uh, uh, infrastructure <laughs> like this, and we must thinking about the uh, standardization and ethics and economical issues. And we must uh, collaborate with the working groups uh, seven uh, 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 as uh, uh, ethics and another uh, issues. And also, we must collaborate with the uh, working group three, AI and robot uh, for the technological uh, aspects. Thank you. Thank you very much.